All right, just one week to go before Chicagoans choose their next mayor and a new exclusive WGN TV Emerson College poll showing one candidate with an edge in a very close race. Our political reporter Tamon Bradley joining us now to break down these numbers. Tamon. Hey Patrick, with crime at the forefront and voters saying they trust Paul Vallis more to handle the issue, the former CPS CEO and city budget chief begins the final week of the campaign with the edge. With eight days left before Election Day, the new WGN-TV Emerson College The Hill poll shows Paul Vallis with the edge in the race for mayor. Vallis holds a five-point lead over Brandon Johnson, 46% to 41%. 13% of voters are undecided. Pessimism about Chicago is soaring. 70% of voters say the city is on the wrong track. 30% say it's headed in the right direction. A majority of those surveyed, 52%, say crime is the most important issue in determining their vote, followed by education, taxes, and housing. When asked who they trust more to handle crime, a majority, 54%, choose Vallis, 38% choose Johnson. It may be the people look at Paul Vallis's specific plans on how he wants to handle the crime issue, which shows his number one, and maybe that's what people believe will get the city on the right track. Race has hovered over the election. Johnson, who is black, is running on an agenda focused on community investments. Vallis, who is white, has leaned into tough on crime policies while courting centrists. The WGN TV poll shows voters lining up along racial lines. White voters overwhelmingly choose Vallis 60 percent to 32 percent, while African Americans back Johnson 55 percent to 25 percent. Among Chicago's highly sought after Latino constituency, Vallis has a clear advantage with support among 57% of Latino voters compared to 30% backing Johnson. Latinos concerns, just like every other Chicagoans, are along the lines of crime and education and they want the best programs for their own families and so therefore it may be that they shift towards Vallis for the very same reasons that other groups are going in that direction as well. To make up ground, Johnson may turn his attention to younger voters who've taken to his campaign. He is ahead among voters 49 and younger, while Vallis has built an advantage among voters 50 and older. Despite a flurry of negative advertising and numerous contentious debates and forums, Chicagoans have a generally favorable view of both candidates. 56% of voters hold a favorable view of Vallis. 53% have a favorable view of Johnson. Live in the newsroom, Tamon Bradley, WGN News.